already love so it's finally done i finally get to show you guys the after how everything looks Woo! i love how it came out and i love that you guys got to do this journey with me so everything i talk about i will be linking down below i will be doing a separate video on my setup how i edit what software to use all that good stuff recommendations everything lighting all that i will be doing a separate video so make sure you guys stay tuned for that make sure to like this video make sure that you're subscribed and make sure you guys leave a comment down below so let's begin so this is how the beauty room is looking so we're gonna move over here and over here this is my desk and I like to have my brushes out in front of me before I would like to have them in the back but then I wouldn't really use brushes that I would want to you know use and I'd have to turn and grab it all that stuff right here I have my sponges don't mind them that they're dirty I have some makeup remover I have the color switch so when you're using a blending brush and you're using a vibrant color you can just switch it on here and then it just removes it have my lip pencils here again my brushes i have my two lights right here i like one facing this way other one facing this way so i don't have any shadows and then the ring light in front of me i have my monitor right here once this is turned on i will be moving the brushes to the side so that i can see myself better I have my fan right there because you guys know i'm bougie with that and then right here i have my skincare i still have to organize that i will definitely be organizing that organizing that very soon but i like it right there so i can just grab it use it all that good stuff so this first drawer right here is my lip glosses my glitter my mascaras eyebrow pencils liquid eyeliner eyebrow pencils again eyebrow gel tweezers eyelash curler eyebrow products over here i like to have this drawer like that and then over here please excuse this this is not organized and there's still some confetti in here so in here i have my primers my foundations and my concealers these are pretty much my go-to my tops that i like using like my top favorites that i like using a lot so they're all in here these are things that i normally use like in a good month you know and then over here are my blotting sheets because when i do foundation reviews i like to show you guys how much oil is on my face so that is that drawer right here so that is everything right here Again, I will link the lights for you guys, the ring light, all the stuff that I have mentioned. And then over here is the back. So over here I have my Smashbox foundation holder. They sent this to me in PR and they had all their foundations in there. I grabbed the foundations that I would want to use and then I used this space to put my foundations because I thought that was so convenient and it twirls so much bigger. So I have my foundations in here, I have primer in here and it works out very, very good. So this is my high-end Ikea drawer. And the top drawer is my contacts. My favorite contacts are from colorcl.com. If you use the coupon Alexis Jada, you can save some money. And they do prescription and non-prescription. So I have all my contacts in here, my favorites, my must-haves. Here is another messy drawer. I still have to organize it. I did order some things off Amazon, but I didn't want you guys to wait for me to do that video. And you guys wait a little bit longer because you guys know shipping right now is taking a little bit longer. So please excuse the mess. So this is my concealer and my primer drawer and my mascara and eyebrow drawer. In here I have my bronzers, I have some blush, and this is mostly like my setting powders. In here I have my highlighters, my blushes, and a little bit of my bronzing. In this drawer I have my powder foundation, Too Faced palette back there, my highlighter, some concealers, some more concealers, and then my Fenty shimmer sticks. Down here I have my liquid eyeshadows from Too Faced. I got some Smashbox palettes right here, my Marc Jacobs palette. Too Faced palette back there and some Fenty lipsticks right here. So kind of just like a mixture. Over here is my high-end liquid lipsticks from Smashbox. I got my KKW, Kim Kardashian, my Too Faced, and some Jeffree Star, some Kat Von D. And that's this drawer. Here is my bronzing and highlighting palettes. 
liquid highlighters some stuff i have tried some stuff i haven't got my becca over here huda beauty my tarte morphe anastasia and urban decay mostly Too Faced over here and then here is my backup drawer this is stuff that i cannot part with my backup of my favorite marula oil there is some marula oil in the giveaway as well so don't worry but this is something that i go through like this because i use it every single day and it's seriously my favorite i'm always talking about it i'm always telling you guys about it it's definitely my favorite and that is my high-end drawer right here and then over here this is all my drugstore so the top is my sunglasses i like to keep them in here i didn't know that i like pink so much but <laughs> there's that drawer in here again the reason why it's not organized the best is because i ordered stuff off amazon i would definitely do an update to this so that you guys can see how it looks but in here is my concealer my mascara my brow my brow products eyeliners primers the best soap bar for your eyebrows this one right here amazing then in here i have my setting powders wet and wild quads essence lipsticks lip glosses my sleek lip dose right here then in here we have my blushes my bronzers we got airspun physician formula cover girl alamar makeup obsession pixie jcap beauty a bunch of my faves la girl over cosmetics all right here then in here we have my liquid eyeshadows from the makeup shack cookie koki then we got my color pop glitter color pop super shock and then we have some l'oreal back there in the nyx palette as well then in here we have my lip gloss drawer my liquid lipstick we have the l'oreal if you guys ever see these on clearance because these are huge out here they're they're always marked down i don't know why no one picks them up they're freaking amazing but you ever see them on sale? I definitely recommend. They are amazing. Got my Morphe. We got ColourPop. We got Annette. We got CoverGirl. We got Ardell. And then in here we have my palettes, my plastic palettes. I have a really cool organizer coming that you guys recommended. So I can't wait for that to come in. I would have displayed it over here, you guys. But you guys wouldn't have been able to see it as well. And it, it would have just thrown all this off. So that's why they're in here. Then in here is my highlighting and contouring. So we got Revlon, LA Girl, Ofer Cosmetics, Annette, L'Oreal, CoverGirl, Maybelline, Essence, Measurable Difference, Morphe, uh, Physician Formula, bunch of faves. I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but I'm obsessed with highlighter. And then down here is just my backup drawer. I have my shadow shields, some Halloween stuff, and just things that I just haven't tried yet and I just need to get to. And yeah, so that is my drugstore one. So now let's go over here. I left my acrylic organizers above i didn't want to put them down here because i feel like that wouldn't have looked nice and up here i like how it looks so mostly up here it's just like my liquid lipsticks and stuff like that we have my cool el maquillage concealer i think it looks so cool displayed right here it looks so freaking nice let me just move this out of the way real quick so this is mostly my liquid lipsticks my glitters this is where i put all my high-end brushes this would be on my desk, but I like how it looks here. But yeah, favorite. And then I have some of my stones in here. And then I have um, gifts that Bam Bam have sent, jewelry. And then over here is my minis. I did empty, empty it, you guys. I did declare that. And then some stuff I've had for a while, and it's just sentimental. So I hold on to a lot of sentimental things because... It just means a lot to me, you know? And then there's my El Maquillage. So here is the shelf that my babe got me for Mother's Day. It looks so freaking beautiful, you guys. I'm obsessed with it. It seriously makes me so happy. So this one over here, we have some Smashbox. We got all of my Anastasia, my Dose of Colors. We got Fenty, Alamar, Alamar. And then we got my Tarte. Oh, I always wanna say Tasha, Natasha Denona. Then we got my Too Faced over here. This is pretty much all Too Faced. I could not fit the mini Too Faced in there because they would have thrown it off. But mostly Too Faced right here. We got BH, Urban Decay, Kim Kardashian, Morphe and Jacqueline. Then we got Shop Miss A, Kat Bondi. And then over here, BH, Makeup Revolution. 
We have Makeup Obsession, LA Girl, The Beauty Crop, um, Violet Voss, The Balm, Smashbox, and The Rock. And then you guys can see my it Cosmetics brushes in the back that I wanted to show to say hello. So that is that row right there. And back here we have my really, really cute cup displayed. And then over here we have my Juvia's Place collection all right here i do have a palette back there that i still have to review but this is mostly my juvia's place right here right here we got some color pop ultra ego more color pop over here and then over here we got my smashbox my Too faced like my minis pretty much huda beauty fenty urban decay and then my favorite my youtube plaque this wouldn't be possible if it wasn't for you guys. So thank you guys so, so, so much. I really appreciate you guys so much. Thank you, thank you very, very much. Over here, we have my Physician Formula, LA Girl, The Makeup Shack, Morphe, Tati Beauty, Ofer Cosmetics, Jcat Beauty, Milani Cosmetics, Pinky Rose Cosmetics, Physician Formula, Winky Lux, and Too Faced. And then my other cup over there, I see you. Then we have my Rock Pro, James Palette, Morphe, Game of Thrones with Urban Decay, my fave, Shane and Jeffrey. Then we have the ColourPop collection, the Frozen collection, and then we have all Jeffree Star right here. And then that is that section right there. Then down here, I have my ColourPop and Sailor Moon package that it came in and I just can't part with it. My El Maquillage and Carly Bible lipstick collection that I came out with, my Drunk Elephant, my Too Faced Metallic Lippies are in there. Then we have my Physician Formula. And then here is just more skincare. Again, my Drunk Elephant. Then right here we have my Juvia's Place Foundation Sticks that I need to review for you guys. It Cosmetics Lippies that I need to review for you guys. L'Oreal Lippies, Urban Decay Blushes, and more L'Oreal. Then over here we have Urban Decay Lip glosses, MAC lip glosses, L'Oreal Nude Collection, and then this came in the, th the Game of Thrones. And I just liked how it looked right there. So that's why that is there. And then that is that section right there. And then over here, we have my Smashbox mini palettes. Back there, we have my LA Girl palettes, some more L'Oreal liquid lipsticks, and then some goodies that I need to review for you guys are in here. And then this section right here is Things I already have hauled in my PR, like I unboxed them for you guys that I need to use in upcoming videos. So I thought it'd be really convenient to have them right here so I can see them. I was gonna use a black cubby to like put in here, but then I was like, I can't see it. I won't use it because it's like hidden, you know? And then over here is some PR that I've already unboxed, but I'm going to redo it for you guys because the video did not save to YouTube for some reason, I'm not sure why. And then over here we have our Ardell eyebrow goodies that I want to use and show you guys. We got some Profusion Cosmetics, Koki, Morphe, and Jcat Beauty back there. And I wanted to display it here so again I could use and I could grab and use them. I didn't display these ones again because it just doesn't look flattering, you know. But I still wanted them to be seen so that's why they're right there. And that is everything that are in these cubbies. So moving on over here, this is my Impressions Vanity Mirror. Then right here you guys see my Canon G7X vlogging camera. I love this one, it is so good. Obsessed, does the job, and what I like about this one, the camera pops all the way out. So if you need to see yourself and make sure that you're being recorded, this is amazing. I highly, highly recommend this one. I love it so much. Over here we have my display that I had in the background before I did the whole revamp and I just didn't clutter it this time. I feel like this looks a lot better. It's not too much going on. It's just less is more sometimes, you know? So you can get this at Ross, at Burlington, at Michaels. You can pretty much get this everywhere now, which is freaking awesome. So this is how this section looks right here. We have my Gorilla tripod right here. That is freaking amazing. You guys want something that's sturdy and that's gonna get the job done? That is your man right there. Right here, we have my Drunk Elephant fridge. I love it. Thank you so much, Drunk Elephant. It's amazing. Over here, we have all of my setting sprays, high-end and drugstore. I thought it'd be convenient just to put them all right here. So I have them all right there. 
Over here we have some eyeshadow palettes, my beauty sponges, some more eyeshadow palettes right here. Over here we have more of my Drunk Elephant products. Here we have some skincare, some foundation. We have some of my eyelashes right here. I thought it was really convenient just to put them in the bag. It's just super convenient to have them in there, I feel. And then over here, I'm going to fill this little section up with my nail supplies. So I thought that'd be convenient just to put them right there. Here are just some really cute bags that I have. All my face mask and my headbands. And then over here is some PR, my Too Faced lip injections, my CoverGirl True Blend collection right here. Some more um, skincare. This one is from It Cosmetics. And then I got some acrylic kits that I need to play with. And then this is empty, but it did have eyelashes in there. So this is my desk area. This is where I edit. If you guys want to know what this is, this is a mini ring light. You can adjust it to like cool temperature, warm temperature, depending on whatever you want. And it has like a little clicker. I will link that. It's super, super convenient. And yeah, this is like my desk. Got some watermelon right there. Got my purse on the side. My daughter's art supplies. Her painting that she drew me. Freaking amazing. I love her work. And this is where, yeah, I do all of that. <laughs> and then my chair right there and then up here are some of my pr packages that i saved that i just cannot part with i got the jacqueline hill pr kit right here from morphe the becca got some fenty beauty drunk elephant Too Faced. when i did a collaboration with flower beauty they sent me some of these really really beautiful roses i've had these forever and they are just gorgeous and then l'oreal they custom made this for me to put my name alexis jada and my name is even on the hairspray which is freaking amazing so i love to put it there and it just i'm just so grateful and then over here we have some more Too Faced. we got some smashbox urban decay packages morphe packages and my Too Faced roller skates are up there so oh yeah and then my um disneyland headband but this is an area right here that I just, I love looking at. It makes me extremely happy. That is my beauty room, you guys. This is it, you guys. This is my area where I get to unwind, create, and just relax and have a good time. Play with makeup. Before, it wasn't like this, you guys. I did not have a room to do all of this stuff. So don't think that, oh, she, you know, I, I started off with the room. Oh, she started off with a really good camera. No, I started off with my cell phone and I started off in the Harry Potter room, literally <laughs> like a little Harry Potter room recording videos and recording on my phone. So it's all possible, you guys. And I want to thank you guys so much for making this possible. And I'm truly grateful. And I love you guys so much. You guys have supported me and showed me so much love. And I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm truly blessed. And there's not a day that goes by that I'm not extremely grateful for everything. I just want to thank you guys so much. Stay tuned. I will definitely be doing a video of showing you guys my setup, all that stuff, how I do it, and all that. But I will link everything that I did show you guys. So if you guys are interested in it, you guys want to see any of it, all that, it will all be linked down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for your time. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!